선배님 드리려고 제가 직접 구웠어요. 제 마음 받아주세요. 하이 앤 웰컴 백. Korean dramas have taken the world by storm and continue to be popular all over the globe. They bring a unique flavor to television entertainment and take viewers on an emotional journey. If you're looking for some classic Korean dramas to watch in 2023, this top is for you. Number 10. Suspicious Partner No, ji is a clever prosecutor while Yoon Bong-hee is a rookie crime investigator, which is why she always ends up as a suspect of the criminal she is investigating. Bong Hee tends to be falsely accused of killing her ex-boyfriend, and Ji Wook's career and reputation are often damaged because of sending him into battle to save Bong Hee. As a professional's career and personal life become integrated, one element can come between them, uncovering the true perp responsible for a series of murders before they run out of time. My friend Ji Wook was close to Ji Yun Hyuk in his youth, and their friendship was the strongest sense. During Yoon Hyuk's troubling adolescence, Ji Wook felt relieved to have a friend like Ji Wook. Suspicious Partner has a 7.8 rating in IMDb. Number 9. The Two. Two was a former mercenary in an elite military unit who received the nickname Two after he escaped on a deserted island while on a mission in Iraq. He found his way back to South Korea, used his military experience to work as a bodyguard for Justice Security Chief Choi Yoo Jin, who was the wife of Jang Si Joon, who was running for president at the time. Later on, Jae Ha uses his new job to plan his revenge on Park Kwon Su, the leader of the current ruling party and Si Joon's rival, whom Ji Hae believes ordered the murder of his girlfriend. Once Jiha is assigned to protect Goena, the reclusive daughter of Sejon who is reclusive, they develop feelings for each other. But what happens when the person who wants to hurt and uh, the most is Yu Jin, Jiha's boss and the accomplices Jaha? Where does Jiha's loyalty lie? The two has a 7.8 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Number 8. Boys Over Flowers Jandai's father and mother own a dry cleaner, and one day she makes the courageous decision to save a neglected student from committing suicide by making the trip to Shenhua High. Because of this expertise, Jan Di is awarded a scholarship and attends this wealthy school. In Shenhua High, she enjoys the popularity of the arguably most powerful group at Shenhua High, consisting of Gu Jun Pyo, the leader of four and heir to the Shenhua group, Yoon Ji He, grandson of a former president of South Korea, a skilled potter from a family which owned the country's largest art museum, and Song Woo Bin. The famous Clayton family operates the country's largest construction company. Sarah's childhood is stressful as she doesn't fit in with the other children in her class because of her social status, and things get even worse when she is the four. Boys Over Flowers has a 7.8 rating in IMDb. Number 7. Sassy, Go Go In the highly competitive setting of a college admissions academy that emphasizes raising rank above all else, the drama will not only expose the hypocrisies involved in academia, but also show the development of the students who grapple with moving forward, one step at a time. Sassy, Go Go has a 7.3 rating in AMDB. Number 6. Kill Me, Heal Me Che Du Haiyan was traumatized at the hands of a traumatizing event, resulting in amnesia and dissociation. This has given rise to seven different personalities. He seeks help from Oh Rai Jin, a first-year psychiatric resident, so that he can regain control of his own life, but Oh Rai Jin ends up falling in love with one of his personalities. Rai Jin's twin brother, Oh Rai On. A renowned mystery writer investigates Du Haiyan and his family. Kill Me, Heal Me has a 8.3 rating in IMDb. Number 5. Coffee Prince 
Hun Jul is the son of Bang of Dong, in Foods, a coffee company with a flourishing business. He has never been employed and has no desire for responsibility. Beginning at age 13, Han Jiu was hung up on his earliest love, Han Yu Ju, who only sees him as a friend. Anja Go is a 24-year-old tomboy who is often mistaken for a man. She lost her father when she was 16 years old, and since then, she has taken on the leading role in her family. When Han Jiu and Yun Shan meet, he mistakenly assumes that she is a woman and hires her as his gay lover as a means to keep away from the dates set up by his grandmother. When his grandmother demanded a deal from his great-grandmother Han Jul, he sprung for a rundown coffee shop renamed Coffee Prince that symbolizes his position as a household servant. In order to attract female customers, he hires only good-looking male employees. Yun Chan, anxious for money, continues to conceal her gender to get a job at the Coffee Prince. Coffee Prince has a 8.2 rating in IMDb. Number 4. The Heirs Kim Tan is the heir to Empire Group who has been sent to study abroad in the USA. In reality, it's a form of exile as his elder half-brother back home schemes to take business away from you. While in America, Kim Tan meets Che Yoon Sang, who arrived from Korea in search of her older sister. He sees himself falling for her, never realizing that she is the daughter of his household's housekeeper. After Rachel Yu arrives to bring him back to Korea, his heart is torn between love and duty. The Heirs has a 7.5 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Number 3. Queen in Haiyun's Man Scholar Kim Bong Du is the historic figure who supplied support to the return of Queen in Haiyun when Zhang He Bin's ideas caused her to be deposed as King Suk Jong's consort. He traveled to the future metropolis of Seoul and met up with performer Choi Hee Jin, who was expecting a notoriety increase through her role after a period of unemployment owing to television roles. Queen and Hyun's Man has a 7.9 rating in IMDb. Number 2. Pinocchio The idealistic photographer Choi and Hae has her work cut out for her when she becomes a network news anchor, as one of her conditions is known as Pinocchio Syndrome, which causes her migraines whenever she knowingly lies. Her colleagues include Shoei Dalpo, whose shabby appearance hides his sharp intelligence and remarkable memory. Seo Bum Jo, a very wealthy heir who has been handed everything in life already. And Yeon Yu Ra, whose fangirl knowledge helps her become an effective journalist. The newest members of the editorial team attempt to win justice while working out their personal issues. Pinocchio has an 8.1 rating in series like Alchemy of Souls, Revenge of Others, or The First Responders, but they are not available in your country due to geographical restrictions, you are in luck. NordVPN can help you with this problem. Right now, NordVPN is offering a mega discount plus four free months with the exclusive link that is in the description. If you want to access thousands of series from all over the world on your favorite streaming platforms like Netflix, Prime Video, or Hulu, NordVPN is the perfect solution and you will surely be satisfied, and if you are not, they offer you 30 days to make a return and you will get all your money back. Now, let's get back to the video. Number 1. My Love from the Stars Du Jun's nickname is an alien who landed on Earth 400 years ago during the Joseon Dynasty. He possesses a perfect physical appearance and enhanced capabilities related to his gaze, hearing, and running speed. Later, he realizes he has three months left on Earth. That is when he meets Cheon Song Yi, the king of Hallyu music in Korea. My Love from the Stars has a 7.4 rating in IMDb. Do you like this video? Check others' videos here and subscribe to be notified about our most recent videos. See you next time. Goodbye.